Rub up your engines! Today, by popular demand, I'm going to talk about stupid car slogans. Now, car advertising slogans have been around just about as long as cars. The first car I had in 1898 simply said, dispense with a horse. It said what it did. And in 1912, Henry Ford said, our advertisements never attempt to be clever. Well, in the beginning, perhaps not. But they certainly changed. Especially after World War II in the United States, they started to get futuristic and just crazy, insane ads. Like you were going to outer space in your car with a giant fence. It started to get ridiculous. And of course, today and in the future, the digital ad revolution has taken over. And it's been forecasted by 2021. There's going to be $5.8 billion in ad revenue for cars in the United States digitally. So needless to say, a lot of money is being spent to get you to buy a car. As any advertising scenario goes in the world these days, sometimes it's just plain stupid, either by design or by innuendo or even ironically. My all-time favorite is the GM one where they had the song, like a rock, like a rock. Do you really want a car that's like a rock? Hard, sits there, doesn't move. <laughs> it's, it's getting to be ridiculous, but they're trying to sell cars with songs. Songs about being like a rock. Well, <laughs> they don't use that one anymore, but to me, that's one of the all-time dumb ones. Now, Fiat Strata had one hand-built by robots. There's an oxymoronic one if there ever was. <laughs> Then there was the old Buick one. When better automobiles are built, Buick will build them. This is insinuating that Buick doesn't build very well made cars today. <laughs> and another Buick one, this one gets me. It makes you feel like the man you are. Okay, more than half of the country is women. So you just cut out half of the population in your advertisement. Unless you have a whole bunch of women who want to be like men. <laughs> Another crazy one from the past is Mercury. At the sign of the cat. What's that? They leave hairballs all over the place? <laughs> or they pee on everything marking their territory? <laughs> Granted, it was for the Mercury Cougar. The Mercury Cougar was actually a Ford Mustang. Underlying the frame, engine, everything was the same. It was just a different body put on top of the Mustang frame. So they had to get something to make it different. But at the sign of the cat, eh, maybe not such a great slogan. And of course, let's throw the Germans in here. Last year in the United States, Volkswagen spent more money advertising than any other car manufacturer in the United States. One of their old slogans was, it's not a car, it's a Volkswagen. So if a Volkswagen isn't a car, what the heck is it? An animal? Is it a mineral? What is it if it's not a car? <laughs> Cadillac once used the slogan, the penalty of leadership. Well, I guess the penalty of leadership is that you fall out of the leadership and now make junky cars that fall apart and cost a fortune. <laughs> Of course, there they're going for the snob factor. Maybe all the CEOs, they thought they were going to buy Cadillacs. What about the common man, you know? I guess they didn't care about that. And Audi following up on their snob appeal, their slogan was, never follow. So I guess you can't buy an Audi and drive it in the city of Houston because there's traffic jams everywhere and you're always following people. <laughs> Or if you take that seriously and zoom by everybody, soon you'll be followed by the police. They're going to give you tickets for speeding. <laughs> Another doozer was Volkswagen again. Drivers wanted. What's this like? A crappy restaurant where it sells help wanted on the outside? They're begging for people to come buy their cars? Not such a good sign. Maybe it lost something in translation from the German. Then there's Nissan's old slogan. Built for the human race. Well, what is it built for? Cats, dogs to drive them around? Snails? Another oxymoronic one. <laughs> I really wonder, did people stay up night losing sleep coming up with these stupid things? <laughs>